Hey, it's a party, it's a party, it's a party. Welcome to the Phillips Fam Baby Journey. I am Raquel and I am super pumped today because one, you're going to go ahead and subscribe to this channel. And secondly, because me and my husband's children book series, Father Figures, yes, 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 is available right now today on Amazon. That's right, your girl. I'm a published author out here in these streets, okay? And I would love for you to support. Now, I know you're asking, what are these books about? So, boom, check it. Here you go, the book trailer. We want to inspire more African-American kids to get excited about reading. So the project is a children's book series for boys and girls. It's called Father Figures. And our whole mission with the project is to increase the literacy rate for African-American kids. What will help increase that rate is kids seeing, black kids seeing book characters and books that look like them. In addition to that, authors that look like them. The storyline behind Father Figures is for kids growing up without fathers, helping them realize that even though their biological father may not be in the home, there's father figures around in their life that can help mold them and give them those life lessons that a father would give. When my husband approached me with his idea for Father's Figures, I was like, wow, that is a great idea. But I was like, oh, what about the girls? <laughs> because I'm all about, you know, female empowerment and I don't want little boys to have, you know, such a great tool so that they can, you know, start reading and learning from and not give the same opportunity to girls. So I wrote the female version of it so that little girls can also enjoy our series. And the focus really in the book is to inspire them to seek father figures for mentorship and not just think, oh, I'm out of, I'm out of luck just because I don't have a biological father in the house. And in the girls' version, in addition to that, I also want to introduce them to careers that are typically filled by men. So the father figures that Tina encounters in her book are in roles as far as a pilot for an airplane, a chef, um, builders. These are roles that women typically aren't seen in, so having them as mentors is something that I also wanted to give little girls something to aspire to. In my opinion, it's for any kid that enjoys reading. I mean, granted, it is specifically targeted towards young African-American kids, I would say grade levels, second to seventh grade. Um, but any kid that, you know, regardless of race, if they need a father figure in their home, this would be a great book for them. If they're a little girl and they're looking for possible career mentors, this would be a great book. If there are a kid who's looking for life lessons, this would be a great book. So there's a lot of kids that this book can be impactful for, but it was initially targeted towards young African-American kids who did not have fathers within their homes. Yeah, and I know, especially from a boy's perspective, especially once they get around the age of, say, like, hitting puberty, 10, 11, 12, they, they don't have a father figure at home. They really feel that void. They don't feel that they have someone they can identify with, that positive male figure. So this book certainly serves them to help open their eyes to opportunities outside of, like I said, going back to just their biological father who may not be there for whatever reason. But looking at teachers, coaches, family members, any of those positive male role models can help fill that void and teach them those life lessons.